today uh, we are covering the next topic uh, in the same chapter that is financial markets and uh, the topic is secondary market. We have already covered uh, primary market, today we will be discussing secondary market. So what secondary market is? Secondary market is a market for the sale and purchase of previously issued securities, right? There are certain securities which are issued by a company to the investors. And this secondary market provides a platform to the investors who are uh, there, you know, who are there to buy and uh, sell those securities, fine. It is the place, it is not the place of origin of security. So, in the second market, the securities which are already issued, right, they are uh, being you know or transacted right the transaction of such securities which were previously issued by any company to the investors takes place fine so primary market in primary market as we discussed earlier that in primary market companies they issue right securities to the investors right so there is a direct uh, link between the company and the investors and the transaction uh, or the sale uh, sale of securities takes place between the company and the investors fine whereas in secondary market the transaction right or the sale and purchase of uh, securities takes place between the investor and the investor fine so one investor who is interested in you know converting the securities into cash fine such investor sell the securities to the other investor who is who is willing to buy the securities fine so there is no direct uh, you know uh, link between the company and the investors whereas the link between the investor and the investors who are willing to buy and sell their securities so investor one investor to the sale and purchase or the transaction takes place between both of them fine by doing such activity they convert securities into cash hence it provides secondary markets secondary markets they provide liquidity to the existing securities fine so if this particular market is not there secondary market is not there then such securities will not be in cash fine so it provides a medium to convert such securities into cash fine and the transaction, the sale and purchase, it takes place at a certain fixed place that is called the stock exchange, fine. The sale and purchase or transaction takes place at the stock exchange, fine, and through a broker, right. In a stock exchange, there are some brokers, brokers, they bring together then both the investors who are willing to buy and sell the securities broker brings them together fine and for providing such services he charges the brokerage fine now there are certain uh, more features of uh, secondary market like the securities which are traded in uh, secondary market they are traded cleared and settled within the regulatory framework of sebi fine so it is guided and regulated by the framework of sebi next uh, feature says that secondary markets do not directly contribute to the capital formation, but it contribute indirectly. How indirectly? That it provides a facility to the investors that they can exit any time from the market and any time by purchasing the security of any company, they can become a member of any company. Fine. If any investor is buying the shares of a company, right, through the other, other investor, so indirectly he is becoming the member of that particular company. So that's why it pro, it uh, indirectly it uh, you know contributes to the capital formation. Fine. Now we'll discuss about uh, the difference between the primary market and the secondary market. There are certain bases. The first basis says the issue issue. Securities, they are issued by the company as we just discussed that uh, securities are directly sold to the investors, fine. And there is a transaction between uh, uh, the investor and the company, fine. Whereas in the secondary market,